All right, we just got to Costco. Still not my favorite store, but there are a few holiday favorites, so I'll show you those. Do you guys think we can get in and out in 20 minutes? Do you think that's uh, ever possible at Costco? No. Please. Should we try real I hard? Mean, we would be able to if it weren't as big of a building, because you can get lost very easily in there. You get lost in there. Yeah, that's true. I've heard you all describe Costco as big carts and so much math. I think that's the best way to describe it. All right, we're going to head in and see if we can do this quick. Oh no, we spotted the huge squishmallows. This is why I don't normally bring kids in with me when we come here, right? Those are gigantic. <laughs> and honestly, I have such a love and hate relationship with Costco. No. I feel like it encourages impulse buying and overspending, but they do have some kind of unique, cool things there and some of the specialty foods that I like to get. So I don't go in super often and I really try to go in with a game plan. So today I do want to glance at the toys. Sometimes they have some kind of neat gift ideas for this time of year. And I try to help my mom out with gifts for all of the grandkids. So we'll take a quick glance at the toys and then we want to get some turkey for Thanksgiving and also a few of like their specialty dips. Oh, and some Christmas lights. And then other than that, I'm really going to try and keep the blinders on. No. <laughs> Which one would you want if you were to get one? Um, probably this one. That one. How about you, Corbin? Or actually... A penguin. Oh, yeah. A penguin? <laughs> Cute. Really All right. Well, you can add it to your Christmas list, okay? Uh, All right. Ooh, these are pretty. $19.99. Yeah. That's really pretty. So right when you come in, you see these. I'd be curious if you have these in other parts of the country because I think they're so pretty. And for the price, they're very big and they're heavy and there's a lot in them. So I think for $34.99, these are actually a really good deal and they're really pretty. But I'd be curious if these are at all Costco's or just around here. Okay, I do want to look at Christmas lights real fast to see if their LED lights are good prices here. So, let's see if we can find those. This is really pretty for only $9.99. That would look nice outside our door, wouldn't it? But the dogs, the dogs will take it away and chew it. I know. What if we nail it down? Hmm, I'm going to think about that. I really like that. <laughs> I have heard really good things about these pretzel crisps if you need a quick, terrible. they look terrible, they look so good, don't they? If you need a, a treat to bring somewhere. We were trying to find some more Christmas lights for my parents' house, but it just it only sees like white. $17.99 for 200, two sets of 100. How many feet are there? I don't even know if this is a good price or not. All right. How how long are the strands though? All right. Well, I think we'll grab one of these. All right. Corbin found what he wants: an electric bike, four hundred and ninety-nine dollars. You're probably gonna have to save up your money for that one, Corbin. Okay. All right. I don't like this. Gage wants an arcade game, five ninety-nine. You guys have good taste. Let's keep walking, okay? I think we somehow got to the expensive aisle here. Oh, laser tag. Actually, this is a good price. Laser tag, a four piece set for $39.99. This is a really good price. Maybe, yeah. Would you like that for Christmas? Okay. Oh, Corbin likes the ax throwing set. You can see it set up up there. Would that be fun? I don't know how I feel about that. <laughs> oh, is this a drone? $69.99. Wow, that's pretty cool. All right, you can add it to your list. All right, add it to your list. Add it to your list. Okay. I actually wanted to see they had a bath set, like a bathtub set here for little kids last year. That was really cool, um, but it sold out right away. So I was going to see if it was here, but so far I'm not seeing it. Those are kind of cool sleds, aren't they? You can fit two people on them. $17.99. That's, that would be a good gift. Do you think we'll have a snowy winter? Will you get to go sledding? American Girl dolls. Oh man. Oh my. Bu bumper cars? Wow. <laughs> $199. Oh, look at them up there. It's pretty good size, but no. I no. <laughs> wow. Oh, careful, buddy. No. That no, no. Don't, don't take it down though. Wow. 
That is huge. Oh, this is kind of a fun set of card games. Uno, Blank, the kids really liked Blank when they were younger. Oh, yeah. So that, was my that would actually, game. That was I would recommend game. that set. I think that would be a really good that was gift my set. Game. Okay, so this is what I was talking about. This bathtub um, ooh, activity set. So it just has like Not different tub paints and crayons um, and different things. So I think that would be a fun gift for little kids. All right, we're trying to figure out what this is, a beat board. You don't know what it is, Gage? You haven't seen it before? Flip it back over. It says, a fast on your feet balance challenge. That kind of looks fun. $49.99. We might have to look into that more when we get back home. That looks kind of cool. All right, Corbin found a car. Is it just a model car? Yes. Ooh, that looks pretty cool. What kind of car is it? Um, it's a Lambo. Wow. Another Bugatti, another oh, Lambo. Um, a, 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 a Wow. All right. Well, I think, oh, let's see if there's, oh, here we go. Lego sets. We still love Legos, of course. Oh, what else did you find? Oh, a drifting car. That's cool. Is it remote control? Yes. Oh, that's actually really cool. You guys would like that. $28.99. Oh, those would be fun. All right, oh. put them back, we'll add them to your list, okay? And I know you are getting bombarded with Black Friday specials, but I do want to let you know that our Take Your House Back course, this is the cheapest Black Friday through Cyber Monday. It is the cheapest it ever is all year, just $84. And so it is a steal. That is such a good price for the value that you get in it. So again, this course was created by myself, Cass from Clutterbug, and Dana from A Slob Comes Clean. And the amount of decluttering that gets done after uh, friends go through this course is phenomenal. The course is so impactful. I know we share a lot of tips and tactics on our YouTube videos, but there is something about the three of us coming together, sharing all of our best tactics. When you join the course, you become part of a really supportive community that are just there cheering you on, encouraging you, helping you to make good decisions. And you really get caught up in the momentum and the energy and the motivation within the course. We have lots of great events throughout the year. We have all day declutters. Every two weeks we have live Q and A's. It is jam packed with value and motivation and accountability. And all the things you need if you've just struggled with getting your house decluttered. So please ask for this for Christmas, gift it to yourself, gift it to someone else that you know, it is a steal at $84. I don't endorse a lot of things, right? But this all day long, I will tell you it is worth every single penny and you are worthy of having a simplified and decluttered home. I really want that for you in the new year. So I'll put all the details for that, but this low price only goes through Monday. So hopefully you can take advantage of it before then. I think this looks like a fun set too. Our, our kids always love playing like kitchen and house and that kind of stuff. So for $24.99, I think that's a good deal. What do you think? When you were younger, did you like playing with that kind of stuff? Um, we didn't really actually have that kind of stuff. Yeah, you had more like play food and stuff. Would you have had fun with that? Yeah, probably. Yeah, probably. They usually have some fun stuff in the books too. Oh my goodness, how cute are those? I don't know if for $20, but they're super cute in these box sets of books. Wow, I think this is bringing me back to my <laughs> childhood. Calendars. Oh yeah, the Roald Doll collection. Oh wow, that's like the full collection. I read these books when we were growing up. I started reading them to the kids at bedtime and they're so strange. We actually stopped reading <laughs> them. So cute. Kids books. Oh, this is really cute. Never pop a penguin gift box. That is super cute. They have some really fun books. Okay, I think we're gonna skip the clothes section because nobody needs clothes. Let's go, let's go get the food that we need to get, okay? Okay, this was actually one of the other things. Usually they're at the front of the store, but um, they have local gift cards and you get like $100 in gift cards for $75. And so one of our favorites if you're in the Twin Cities area is the Chianti Grill. And so, ah, I have to drop this. So I think we're gonna grab a couple of these to try, try and get a little bit of Christmas shopping done early. They also have them for like activities like bowling and movie theaters, Nickelodeon Universe. So anyways, kind of a good deal. Okay, this is one of the things we're here for, for Thanksgiving, instead of doing a big turkey, we're gonna get two of these. All right, Gage, hold that one. And that one. Now you got them both? No. Nope. All right, thank you. 
Okay, and then we're just gonna grab some dips to have to snack on after the main meals. Okay, KJ, can you grab one of the buffalo chicken ones? That is always a favorite. And then, like should we get Mexican street corn or the spinach and artichoke with jalapeno? I don't know. She goes. <laughs> Which one would you pick? The Mexican street corn or the spinach and artichoke dip with. I like the one with the jalapeno. I don't know if we see that one though. Do you like either of those? I've never had any. All right. I think we'll go with the street corn. I think that's probably the most people will like that one. All right. Then we'll get some tortilla chips. Thank you. We also like to grab the taco kits when we're here. So I got one for my mom and one for us. Hey, our cart's not too full. We're doing pretty good so far, guys. But in 20 minutes? Yeah, we're, we probably already hit 20 minutes, right? All right, let's keep moving. Yeah, it's beef. So this is another kind of treat when we come here. It is so good if you have not had this before. So we're gonna get one for Nana and Grandpa and one for us, yes. Thank you. We're back over by the dips. I've never had the queso here, but we do like a good queso. Is this good or not good? I don't know. We'll try it. You all let us know what you think about it too. Okay. What else do we need? Now I feel like we're forgetting things. Reese's. Reese's. Oh, yeah. No. <laughs> These are really cute. They're hot uh, hot cocoa tins. $10.99 for a four pack. I don't think that's bad. They're super cute. So that would be kind of fun to get. Yeah, there's all different ones. Yeah, wouldn't that be kind of fun? Oh, a salted, I didn't see their different flavored. Salted caramel, marshmallow, peppermint, milk chocolate. Oh, that would be a really good one to <laughs> That's fun. Oh, I remember these from last year. Our friends said these are very good. The stroop waffles. Should we try a box? We didn't, they're only, they're only $6.99 right now. Instant savings. All right. I think we'll grab some since we didn't try them last year. Everyone says these are awesome, guys. So, so one of the last times I was here, I passed up the Stroop waffles. I don't. I'm probably not saying it right. And you all were like, "No, they're so good. You have to try it out." I love how when you look at the back, the directions to warm it is to set it on top of your coffee cup. Like that just sounds fantastic. <laughs> I love that so much. And I was thinking that when you open the box, they're like in individual packages. That this would actually work really well to put in those glass mugs that I'm showing as like a little gift, like a hostess gift or a friend gift or a teacher gift. And so I do think that is pretty cool. I do kind of regret I passed by the hot chocolate, those little tins. They were really cute. That would have been cute with these like glass mugs as well. So I kind of regret that I passed those up, but not enough to go back <laughs> and get them. <laughs> Oh, what did you guys find? Corman likes corn. How many are in there? Corman 30 counts? All right, so that's way cheaper than buying the bottles, right? Yes. But it's still $21. And really the problem with Costco is that one impulse buy and all of your savings has gone out the window. And so Corbin saw the Prime drink packets, which yes, technically they they are cheaper than the Prime drinks if you buy the bottles. But I wasn't gonna buy Prime drinks today and I just like got caught up in like, oh, the packets are cheaper. And we do use them, them for like a reward for him. He has to do some extra reading stuff. So if he has a good attitude and we get through a string of days with it going really well, then he gets that as a reward. So again, in my head, I'm thinking like, oh, this is so much cheaper. But again, I didn't need them, right? And so it was like, there went any savings, which is that one, that one purchase right there, all savings out the window. <laughs> okay, there was one other thing I just remembered I wanted to look for was this collagen and biotin together. Um, if you follow Bobby from Flav City, he actually recommends this for a good collagen and biotin supplement. So I thought we could uh, test it out. I'll let you know <laughs> if, it's, if I like it or not. And we were able to leave without the boys getting anything. You know, this time of year, it's a little bit easier because I'm like, okay, we'll put that on your Christmas list. We'll put that on your Christmas list. Oh yeah, we'll put that on your Christmas list, <laughs> right? So they added some ideas to their Christmas list <laughs> for sure. Do we want to do self-checkout or self-checkout? Okay, head over behind that gentleman. We've never done the self-checkouts here before. Let's see how this goes. Okay. 
scan your membership card or touch. So I always leave feeling like, I don't know if that was a good experience or not. If I, <laughs> I always leave feeling like I spent more money than I wanted to. Yeah, I got some good things and a lot of them I didn't actually even need. So, you know, this is why I only go every so often. I might go back and get a couple of those Christmas gifts for Corbin and Gage though. There's that, that might be good. But then I have to go back again too. That's not really desirable. So <laughs> I don't know. Oh man. Well, I hope you can join us in the Take Your House Back course if you haven't done so already. That course is gold and I very proudly promote it. But I love you. I hope you have a really good day and I'll see you again soon.